Oh, yeah, lads. I feel a little naked only having two, two graveyard hate spells, but I mean, we've got shamans too, okay. Edict on the sideboard. Uh, Edict just helps with killing planeswalkers, right? So we've got to kill planeswalkers, we've got Edict, Bolt, and, and Minsk and Boo Should be enough. How about Sugar hits, hits uh, Graveyard too? Yeah, but I think it's a uh, three mana card getting to stage two on the saga. Might be a bit too late sometimes, but it might be useful enough sometimes as well. Disturbing lack of goif in this pile. Shit card, in it? Actual shit card. Unironically. Alright, let's go hamster gang. We Jundin. Chat, what do you think about playing Scuffed Wasteland? Is Ghost Quarter the best card in Timeless? Destroy Target Land. Everyone has basics. Well, everyone has, like, one basic, two basics. But you've got four Ghost Quarters, so checkmate. You play Blood Moon and the Ghost Quarter. So they have to fetch their basics anyway. And then uh, GG. You play... Yes, you play Blue, Red, Stifle, Ashiok, Blood Moon, Ghost Quarter. Blue, Red, Land Destruction. Blue, Red, Ghost Quarter, Stifle, Blood Moon, Ashiok, Tidebinder, Stone Rain. Who, who's going to take responsibility for reminding us all? <laughs> not writing it down and definitely not remembering yep true that's how i feel as well okay so <clears throat> a good player would simply find some lands here two lands and win the game counter spell Stifle, Charm, Counter, two Tefs, huh? <clears throat> Full blue, white Gandalf. I haven't really tried the blue, white, man. Blue, white could be fun, though. Uh, what are they drawing? They're drawing another Counter spell. Charm is fine, because I don't have any one drops. Tef is also fine. <clears throat> I think I have to take Stifle, man. Because I've only got one land. If I draw a fetch land, I'm dead. <laughs> Rip. It's their worst card here, of course. But against my hand, it's their best card. <clears throat> Streamer is pretty insane at the game. I don't know if you've ever noticed this before. He's pretty damn good. Wait, what? What is? What cards are in my deck? Do I need more black or more red? I'm a black player. <laughs> Uh, yes. We want them to. We want them to counter Bowmaster, right? So that we can resolve Jarso. So let's uh, pass. They they counter Bowmaster. We play Jarso Thoughtsies. Um. Then they. They counter Bowmaster. We untap, play Jarso, Thoughtseize, hit a Tef. Then they untap, play the other Tef, bounce my Jarso. Then I untap and play Fable, and they've got no Tefs left with enough uh, loyalty to bounce my token. <clears throat> yeah, 
Easy peasy. Okay. Proctor Crocs, oh yeah. Yeah. Unfortunately for us, they don't really have the time to cast the Proctor, so that's not going to be happening. <clears throat> they might they might have cut they might have cast it there because uh I'm about to get a free bowmasters, right? So wouldn't have been bad for them to cast it there. God, Jarso is so unfair, man. <laughs> what an unreasonable card. <clears throat> nice counter spells, opponent. It would, it would be a shame if I just recast every spell, huh? Go on, counter the fable. I wonder what Jarso's plan is next turn. Okay, we know we know they're playing stifle, so let's just fetch our lands when we can. <clears throat> That's not gonna work out for your opponent. Intensity, baby. <clears throat> I think I'm starting to see why people don't play control decks very often. No Minskin Boo. <coughs> yo, yo, any Minskin Boos? Okay, cringe. No free, no 4 3 spell off the of Jarso. What is this scam? Dun, 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 dun. Bruh. Why are you stealing my shit? Wait, well, why is Jarso not attacking? I attacked. I, I clicked on Jarso there. What the hell was that? Bro, I clicked Jarso. She she moved uh move it uh, moved forward. Alright, minus three. That's, that's a minus three. If I've ever seen one. <clears throat> what do I have? I have only yeah, just Jarso and and Crocs. Okay. Leave our ones in there. <clears throat> All right, I think I scammed myself, but maybe maybe Arena scammed me. Hard to tell. Do 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 do. Plus six, nice. Is opponent gonna stifle stifle my fable? It was a it was a shock land.
Wait, why did they shock that in? Do they only have did they only have one white at the time? Okay, I didn't know that was going to happen. <laughs> I did not know that was about to happen. <clears throat> Top deck verdict. Oh my fucking god. Okay. <clears throat> this is a demonic tutor is a good card, I've heard. Oink. <clears throat> Hamster go brrr. <clears throat> Go for the eyes, boo. Bro, why do I only have two veils against fucking blue white control, man? <laughs> well, I feel like we definitely want monkey here. Uh, edict's looking hot. Push is looking not. Mm -mm -mm. What about Bolt? How many Bolts do you play against blue-white control? Uh, they, do, they do have Proctor, actually. But without Proctor, you're only really using them for face or planeswalkers, right? It's a bit sus, but with Proctor... They might they might take their proctors out though because they saw they saw a croxa from me. Bloodman? I mean Bloodman's not that good against blue white, is it? It's a control deck, man, they'll just if they don't have removal for it, then I don't know what to tell you. Bloodman hurts us more than them? I, I think so too, man. Especially when they're playing Mystic Sanctuary, right? They're going to have a bunch of basics with that. There's just not that many named lands in Arena. What am I cutting? What what is bad against them? I guess Hearse is only hitting seven mana deluges. It's not that big a deal. We've already got shaman anyway. Oh, again, bolt is not that good, but we don't want to have no bolts because I guess I'll, I'll cut a fable against the blue white control. One less expensive card. Bro, where are my halflings, man? Make a gre make your first green deck without halfling. Instant blue-white control. Matchmaker is fine. <laughs> the Croxar is, is great, yeah. Okay, so we know opponent plays Stifle, so... You gotta be a little careful with your fetch lands. Island go, huh? I'm actually, I'm gonna do land just in case they have a stifle because if they have a stifle then we don't have any access to red so just get your red and then you can start taking spells Lotus Field. Yep, stifle. 
Okay, I'll crack this while they're tapped out. Lotus Field Blue White in my timeless. Where are my thought seizes, bitch? Monkey, huh? Dead. <laughs> Do they? Do you think they play Wonder and Emperor? We didn't. We didn't see any Wonder and Emperors in Game One, but <laughs> All right, any counter spells opponent for Shaman? Nope. I'd like to dash, please. I'm not playing around Wonder and Emperor and Timeless. If they have it, they have it. Swords? Swords is fine. Okay. Easy monkey. Easiest monkey hit of my life. Please give me a top deck thought seize or veil. I'm begging you. Rip. Thought seize or veil? Thank you. Harvest, good card, yeah. That's a dead death. Come on, move. We're off on another thrilling adventure. Look, we are go big. Or actually, go big. Just go big. Get him, team. Get him, team. Get him, team. Go for the eyes, boo! F3 bounce hamsters got a feel bad, huh? We are large and in charge. We will stomp out evil. You just let me know if you're up for round. Deluge. Um, <clears throat> I mean, I guess I'm not casting that, right? I could cast it if I had five mana, because I could cast it for four and then exile it with a shaman, but... <laughs> Okay, Edict is nice. <clears throat> Dude, is my deck good or is blue white control bad? Maybe. They have dig through time and deluge. Bit greedy, but I respect it. Mm -mm. 
We are large and in charge. Take that, you fiend. No, 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 no. Sacrifice a creature token, please. <clears throat> okay, sideboard monkey popping off there. That was nice. That's why we have the sideboard monkey. They, they should probably play... They had Verdict, especially with Lotus, right? You should be playing Purge instead, I imagine. Okay, seems like a good one, two, three, four curve here. Fellow once upon a timer here. Wow. <clears throat> okay. That's a good hand. That's a good hand. Take Grazer. No, I think you don't. I think you take once upon a time, right? They they have eight grazers in their deck. Or they've got seven more grazers in their deck, so they can find one quite easily with once upon a time. But we don't want to let them. Uh... <sighs> I mean, I don't know. I mean, it's grazer or once upon a time. I don't want to let them once upon a time for a titan. Is what I'm thinking, but. I guess they can't really once upon a time for a titan anyway, can they? They, they have to look for a dork. <laughs> Fine, let, let's try taking Grazer. See what happens. Opponent, please. That's not how you use once upon a time, though. <laughs> Nothing in Timeless triggers me more than people that use once upon a time like this. <laughs> Fucking hell. No. Don't crack it. Don't, no way. Surely not. Off the top, too? Titan players are not that lucky. Okay, nice. Well, chat, all I'm going to say is, on the play, if this, if this 1, 2, 3, 4 loses, we're deleting the deck, so... All Jund fans should be praying that we win here. <laughs> I, I will literally delete the deck if this if we lose this game. I shouldn't have fetched forest because of crocs, man. What are you, some kind of clown? <laughs> right, somehow we're on seven life chat, but that seems fine. Mm -mm. 
Wow, wow. Plus two. Yep, Titan. <clears throat> uh oh. Bog. <clears throat> Bog is okay. Go big or actually go big, just go big. <clears throat> Surely not, chat. We will stomp out evil. One instant in sorcery in the graveyard, huh? Okay. We're going to five here. I need to go to five, so I've got lethal next turn. I can thought seize myself, yeah. That's probably good. Because I need, I need to, I need to play both of my shamans, right? Because <clears throat> I need the the two plus two plus seven to kill them next turn. So thought seems to get a, a like a, a two mana fable seems fine. The game, the game is over next turn either way, right? Either we die here or they die on our next turn. Let's see. <clears throat> zombie at this point zombies don't really matter because we we go over the top anyway so they, they need to they need to gain two life or remove one of my remove one of my creatures But you got opponent, you got more... <clears throat> Do you have another Radiant Fountain? <clears throat> I think another Radiant Fountain is fine actually though, because if they, if they attack with a Titan... Like this, that probably means that we'll be able to attack with our Hamster anyway. So then we'd have enough damage regardless. <clears throat> Magic? <laughs> we have muscle. Knock the evil right out of them. Go, boo, go for the eyes. All right, sick. This game went pretty well. It did, yes. It did. Okay, Blood Moon, Slaughter Games. Do we want this? Kills camis, grazers, and zombies. Undeleted junt, yes. The deck survives for now. <laughs> Let's try monkey. Let's try murderous cut. 
Bow master and push out. Um. I mean, I do. I kind of want to try this, man. I guess, yeah, Ragavan is probably worse than an edict, man. Herso? No, I think Herso is still good, though. They, they don't really care about their graveyard, no, but Hearse is a massive creature, right, in this matchup, which is can be useful. Needle is good against the wall. <coughs> Dead boy, this is sick. But both players have had a once upon a time in both games. This is how you play magic chat, you've just got to be this good. <laughs> Needle against Blast Zone? I, I, I don't actually have a massive amount of one drops man, I've, I only have Shaman. Oh fuck, I forgot I, I have Blood Moon in my deck. Why am I... I need to fetch basics, bro. Natural Order, Titan, Rejuv, They have Bog. <clears throat> Boggy Bog Bog, huh? We have a bolt to kill their next green creature that they plan to use natural order on and then other than that they don't have too much ramp right now. I, I don't know why I didn't use my hearse chat, don't ask me. I didn't, I didn't invite any questions like that, okay? Oh, say you. <clears throat> Alright chat, I'm looking at my hand and... I'm not seeing many threats. Egg Razor's annoying. I mean, we can we can easily kill it with Bolt, but... Uh, it does mean that I won't be able to... <clears throat> ...play Gigantha this turn, but, I mean, Blood Moon's quite a good card, no?
Minus three. Worth it, man. Worth it. <clears throat> Ocha, I guess we're beside you in this forest, huh? <laughs> like they'll they'll have another forest in their deck, of course, but to to bring out right now. Oh no, you can't do that. You cannot pursue your basics. I always forget that. Okay, we're not pursuing you in the forest. One second. <clears throat> Thank you, Auto Tapper. You were you were correct all along. Alright, we've got them down to 16, and we're chilling on 8 right now. <laughs> what a draw for them, man. <laughs> what a draw. Okay, Hoof is coming in next turn. And Hoof is... What is Hoof? A 6-6. Six, six. <clears throat> Point top deck two forests against my Bloodman deck. Pretty good. <clears throat> Pretty good. <clears throat> I mean, I, I can't attack, man. My life total is too low. I can't attack this turn. I can attack once the hoof is a 5 5 at least. <clears throat> Correct. Rip to you see, huh? No attack, huh? <coughs> I feel like they should attack, right? I mean, ne next turn their creature's just a 5-5 five, five anyway. Although I guess, uh, maybe they, uh, did they plan on using Natural Order on the hoof to get a, to get a Titan out? It's so toxic that this shaman can't crew the hearse by itself, man. Because <laughs> I can't, I can't really attack with my Gigantha until there's a, until I can crew the hearse. Do they play a Traxa? That's the question. <clears throat> Most decks don't play a Traxa and Tooth. Traxa is tough, yeah, but I've never, I've never seen a version that had a Traxa and Tooth in it. <clears throat> Ratchet the bomb, la bomba, huh? Oh, now let's do, do be see you. 
to say you, and then I can eat the artifacts with Hearse and eat the. So now, now my Hearse is bigger than their Titan, which is good. I just need to draw a fucking creature, mate. Do we want two damage or two life? Uh, I've only got one green, so we don't have a choice. Good game. I do have a green. I lied. But I'll take my two. I'm feeling aggressive with it today. Ooh. Technically not a creature, but... Pretty good, in my opinion. I'll attack you for seven. Attacking for seven when they're on 14 is pretty nice. Get Blood Moon, the bozo. <laughs> I imagine actually playing such a room temp IQ deck. Me spend more mana than opponent each turn. Me strong. Evil? What do you mean evil? They're the evil one. They're the ones that should be fucking locked up, dude. They're the people that are standing at the front row at the fucking fireworks. Camping out the night before. Dorks. Whoa! Big firework! Woo! Catherine Wheel! Woo! Shut up, man. Davy Jones, bro? Be miserable like the rest of us, you fuckers. That's what I'm saying, man. Nothing pisses me off more than other people smiling. What the fuck have you got to smile about, bitch? You've taken a look at the world recently. Dude, I hate Channeler, man. It's so good, but it's so bad. But it's so good, but it's so bad. What a creature. <clears throat> Ruins player spotted. <clears throat> Okay, chat. In a previous life, I said that demonic tutor is bad. I stand by that, but it is. It does seem to be kind of cool with Jarsul, though. <clears throat> demonic tutor is good if it costs zero. Hmm. True. True. All right, settle down, mate. Settle down, please. <clears throat> Had that so good, <laughs> yeah, man. Yep. <laughs> What the hell is going on here? <laughs> ah yes, two push, what could go wrong? Yeah, two, two C's, sorry. Where are my pushes and my bolts, mate?
Plot me no kill me? I won't. These channelers will kill me though. <clears throat> ah yes, Bowmaster immediately after their channelers flip. Brilliant. <clears throat> fantastic, fantastic, extraordinary stuff. <laughs> right on time, yes. Very cool. Ah, we're going we're going to five. Easy five. Ouch. Top. Top top. Top top top. Top be top be top. Light up. Okay. Land bolt. Really? <laughs> So lucky, man. <laughs> what a luck sack. <clears throat> Land bolt. <laughs> they didn't go face though? Yeah, but I think I'm I'm dead, right? <clears throat> For that. That because uh, I think without that bolt we we will we will win, right? Because I, I can I can tutor my own boat and kill the channeler and then I get to tutor again for free with the jar so and stupid bowmaster one turn too late as well. <laughs> All right, close one. You got me. Yeah, I mean I think this is an actual head out sugu matchup. Huh? I don't see why it wouldn't be. <clears throat> My own monkey? Hey, wire mate. Hey, wire mate. Hey, wire mate. Never seen that card before? This one? <clears throat> it's sick, man. It is sick. Destroy ones and zeros, exile all graveyards, and then make a creature. Very cool. <laughs> Here's me. Tip my monkeys. Anything else? <laughs> Hearse might be better than Croxa. Or like, second Hearse better than second Croxa, I mean. Bro. What the hell is this, man? Where are my cards that cost less than a million, please? Why did you not just pass, Bozo? Surely I'm not taking Swamp. That's... <laughs> 
No way, he can't, right? <laughs> Uh oh. Can I draw a bowmaster this time, please? Nope. <clears throat> Are you joking? Am I about to play against Mono Red where I never draw a bolt, never draw <laughs> a bowmaster, never draw a push? This is a scam. I hope so. What do you mean you hope so, you fucker? I land for my Minskin Boo. <clears throat> Mountain light up the stage. Dude, this is so dumb, man. <laughs> I'm sad. My jar so's alive and it's not doing anything. Look at us. We are not. Go big or actually go big. Any cards that cost one? Hello? Hello? <clears throat> Fourth land? Alright, are we about to get cleaved? A actual three mana three three here with no text, yes. Alright, go on, head out so go off the top, head out so go off the top. <laughs> Alright, I would like to draw four. <clears throat> I have drawn a push. I repeat, I have drawn a push. Play Fable and we'll discard the hearse because the Jarsa will bring the hearse out anyway. That was a good turn, yeah. Blood, nice Bloodman Bozo. Very cool. <clears throat> you can concede. I'll see you in game three, Davy. Thank <laughs> you. 
going well for the Jund boys here. It's going great. Don't know why they play Lantern, man. I think Lantern... You should only be playing Lantern with Luris, right? <clears throat> Otherwise, it's, it's definitely a hearse angle. Lantern is nice with Jarso. Okay, I can see it. I can see it with the Jarsos. <clears throat> A lot of Ferocidons, huh? Ferocidon might justify playing Edict. At least it can trade up a little bit. <clears throat> Especially on the draw. Could be maybe maybe cut a monkey and bring a bring an edict in on the draw. <laughs> All right, I did think that maybe they would take their blood moons out in game two because we're playing Jund, but obviously they're keeping them in, so we'll need to keep playing around it. Might for Blood Moon? Nah, we don't need to kill the Blood Moon, man. We just need to fetch our basics, right? Blood Moon doesn't do anything against us as, as long as we get our basics out. Get rid of a fable so that so that I can get both of my basics with these fetches and then I've got a third land just in case the shaman dies. <clears throat> Monkey. Okay. Guess I do want to draw the monkey, so go blood crypt here shadow spear what the hell okay but isn't that the dino is symmetrical right the ferocidon stops them gaining life too no does it <clears throat> i think it does I'll take it. <clears throat> Shandara, Shandara. Listen, pal, I'm with the gate watch. Artifact so creature land. Be... Okay, so instant or sorcery will will flip our channeler. Sure. Can you please chill me? Any chance you could chill? Nope. No chilling.
Co? We are on 10, chat. Don't know exactly how I feel about being on 10, but... Not great. Not great. Trample prowess, by the way. One thing our deck doesn't do is gain a bunch of life. The, the problem here is that my life total is my life total is too low. I have I have to block the soul scar here, and we're gonna get crushed in combat if they have another spell. I can't take a hit. <clears throat> I mean, it's a yikes. The plus one, plus one from the Shadow Spear actually makes a huge difference here. <clears throat> I can't, I can't take a hit because I will. If they have a, a a removal spell here, I would just die to that anyway, right? Even if I don't block, so. There's not really much choice. <laughs> yeah, Witherbloom command. Wait. It died! Ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Nice! Okay. Go dash my ass, please. Uh, nope. I don't think so. That won't be getting played. <clears throat> Hell no, brother. <clears throat> play it. Fuck off. Play it. Ooh, a little bolt of my own. Alright, it's monkey time, chat. It's monkey o'clock. God, I would love to just gain a little bit of life. One more turn of not attacking with a token, we can we can attack with it next turn. Once our once our fables online. Yeah, Shadow Spear it's quite good when it's on a creature and quite bad when it's not. <laughs> That's my high level analysis.
Free tips, man. I don't, I don't give out free tips lightly. <clears throat> okay, opponent. Well done. Insane order. <laughs> opponent has no regard for their own life total. They, they care only about my life total. Three mana draw two, yep. Minus one. You thought four bowmasters was a lot, chat. What about infinite bowmasters? That's good, right? Ecuador. Ecuador.